Jose in the deal that sent goaltender Vesa Toscala to the Maple Leafs earlier today. And then San Jose flipped spots with St. Louis. And so the Blues, who have three first-round picks, John Davidson and company, picking here at 13, also have a pick at number 24 and at number 26. The result of deals that sent Keith Kachuk to Atlanta and Bill Guerin to San Jose. So who are the Blues looking at? Well, I think they want an offensive hockey player. I think Esposito is a consideration. But the guy who really calls the shots on the on this uh, the St. Louis team, Jarmo Kekalainen from Finland. So they could very well go to the European venue. And there's uh, a number of those guys that are out there for uh, offensive players. Oscar Moeller, St. Louis Lars Eller. Also, say a big thank you to the city of Columbus. You have treated us very well. We've had a wonderful time in your city. And again, thank you very much. We'd like to say hello to Lester's in St. Louis, hosting the draft party for our St. Louis Blues. Hello, everybody there. I'd like to bring up Yarmo Kekalainen, who runs the draft for the Blues Hockey Club. Yarmo. St. Louis Blues select from Frölunda, the Swedish Junior League, originally from Denmark, Lars Eller. And Jarmo Kikalainen, who knows Europe as well as anyone, knows that this is significant, that it's a Dane who gets picked. Uh, Lars Eller, a Dane, sets a National Hockey League record for Danish players. We'll call this guy the Great Dane. Number 87, Peter Regin, was previously the top drafted Dane. This guy now goes in the first round, and that doesn't come as a surprise. His favorite team is the Vancouver Canucks. His favorite player is uh, Daniel Alfredson. And one of the big turning points for him was going to play for Frölunda in the Swedish Junior League. He put up big points there, 19 goals, 59 points. He's a blue blood hockey family in Denmark. His dad played, his dad coached and played on the national team. His brothers played in four world championships for Denmark. And his dad's sweater is currently in the Hockey Hall of Fame on a display in international hockey. One of the issues with this guy is gonna be injuries. He's had a bunch of them, most recently, I heard he was at the Hockey Hall of Fame doing the goalie simulation, making the saves yeah. for fun. And he bounced down to make a save and he hurt his shoulder. So there are a number of injury issues that he has to deal with. But this kid's a smart hockey player and he put up big numbers in the Swedish Junior League. And the Blues like him. Well, the Blues really stockpiled picks to, to turn their program around in St. Louis. And they're putting some nice pieces today, together today with three first-round picks. I'm a little surprised by the pick, to be quite honest. I, I could never get a read on him from our staff because of the injury situations. But uh, obviously, the Blues have a strong presence in Europe with uh, Yermo. And uh, he's a good hockey player. I know Pierre Maguire as well as anyone. I think he's ready to go off. Let's go down to James Duffy. <laughs> I think you may have guessed correctly. Did you ever imagine the day, Pierre, where a Dane would go before a highly ranked Russian in the NHL entry draft? No, absolutely not. And maybe this pick will turn out.